My block jumping like Brian Brian, him a dance move like Prime Time. Bad bitch on the sideline with the pom poms trying to ride mine. I do whatever I want, whatever. Yo, bitch, be whatever you don't. No, don't shoot the messenger, man. This is the message she wrote. Hey guys, this is Coach Clemens. You guys are watching Coach Talk. This video is brought to you by I Only Want the Truth. He is one of the subscribers that did ask my opinion on Jalen Rieger. Um, so I thought I'd make a video on him since I've actually never watched any of his film before. The only thing I did know about him is that he did um, fuck over my fantasy a little bit because he had so many games where he only had one catch. Um, I'll show you guys a couple of the stats here and you guys will be able to see... Um, what he's done production wise over the of over the last year um because i know that he didn't do that well he was like hyped coming into it um but he didn't really do much and it could have been with the quarterback because watching his film the quarterback was a little garbage but still he shouldn't be getting held to only one to three catches a game if if you're gonna be a good receiver in the league you gotta be good in college but we can't really blame Jalen for the quarterback's problems because if he's getting open um, and the quarterback's not hitting him, that's not his fault at all. What else is he going to do? He can't throw the ball to himself. So that's something that we will be able to see in film. And that's the great thing about going over stuff like this um, because when you get those people who only do look at those stats and don't watch the film, that's whenever you get people who don't know what they're talking about because if this is the case and he's just getting open but the quarterback can't hit him because he's throwing a brick, then that's the thing and we're gonna find out today um he has a lot of speed on him um i that is something i did notice as well um he'll catch the ball and he has great explosiveness um i'm hoping if he can develop more at the next level you know who knows what he can be because like he has a lot of potential he has great high pointing on the of the ball he's quick um he's a trash ass blocker so uh maybe tyreek hill <laughs> But maybe that's just, you know, saying a little bit much right now because uh, he's definitely so far not one of the better receivers I've seen in this class so far. But he's not trash. He has shown a lot of flashes, um, which means he has a lot of potential and in, in room to grow. Um, so we'll take a look and um, I'll give you my thoughts. All right. Today we're going to be looking at Jalen Rager. Um, I don't know much about him except for I drafted him in fantasy and he didn't do shit for me. But um, other than that, this is my first time taking a look at him. Um, I seen that his stats, they weren't looking all that good. It looks like he was had a lot of games where he was held only one catch against teams who were ranked. And um, this was one of his only games where he had multiple catches. So I wanted to get um, a film like that. So at least we're able to see him catch the ball instead of seeing uh, only his route running and and stuff like that. So let's take a look into the video um, and I'll stop talking about this. All right, he got a motion and around back. He's open, hit him. All right, there he goes. Oop, okay, all right, oh shit. Ah, oh, what the foot? Hey, he was looking cute out there. He was, he's showing nice bursts, nice speed, nice cuts, just not nice balance. Okay, we got the ghost running. All right, he's out on the outside up there. And we lost him, guys. Did he miss that catch? All right, I like that. I like that, actually. That was a good cut. Um, I like, I like it. He sold it. He sold it well. That was good. All right, they're getting the ball again. Man, I, I I really like his explosion. He is he is quick. As soon as he catches the ball, he's gone. I like that. Rolling out the pocket. Yeah, he we lost him off the screen there. We couldn't see it, what he did. He just uh, looked like he was running a, a go. Got on the motion there. Oh, no. All right. We got another non-blocker. Like I said, most receivers aren't blockers, especially in college when they're just working on their routes and they're catching. Um, if you want to see a blocker, go check out my J uh, my Justin Jefferson video. Um, that's when you'll see a receiver who got some blocking. But that, it looked like he was a little bit scared to um, go up and block that dude. So he's up at the top of the screen again. All right. little stop and go. And he fucking darted him. Ah! 
Oh shit, he caught it. Oh my god damn it. Somebody give me a button to rewind. I swear to God, once I can afford a button to rewind, we gonna be lit. That shit was crazy. Where is he at? There? Oh man. God damn it. I thought Judy couldn't block. Oh no, this is why he didn't get the ball the whole season. They didn't even want him on the field. He can't block. Let's take a look at his route running here. Oh, what the? All right, you gotta show more hustle, dude. You got to. I know if it's a run play, you're not getting the ball, but you gotta, you gotta have more hustle and go and, bo and block the corner. All right, they got him the ball again off the, off a little quick screen there. a little go there hard to see him up at the top of the screen that's the only bad part about him playing there I don't got that good coach film what the fuck was that a punt what kind of fucking throw was that ah, he got him good shit he can't block but he can strip he's the next hooker Yeah, he really can't block. I mean, he did enough to not get the quarterback fucked over there, but, like, he puts no effort into blocking. And blocking is something I really I really like having in a receiver. So them, him not being a blocker, it, it really puts a big old L on him. Um, but, once again, he's not a tight end. Damn, way to catch that fucking ball. Great. He jumped up and high-pointed it right over the corner. That shit was good right there. That was nice. I like that shit. God damn it. Oh, the ass. Look at this. Fuck, that was a great ass catch. That was perfect. Ooh, that was kind of a, a sloppy end right there, but... We're on the red zone. Red zone, dead zone. This is where I'd like to see where the where the coach likes to go. Because when you're in these red zone situations, this is where they're trying to score. And, you know, they're trying to... i like to see who they think their best weapon is. Throwing it to the big boy there. You you knew it was a run play if you just were looking at fucking Jalen right there. He was he was like talking shit, didn't even put his hands up. He knows he can't block. Alright. Ooh, he was under pressure there. He's open. Good shit. Found it. That was a good route on that zone play. He was just sitting right there in the pocket, no one around him. Oop. Ah, oh, this. We can't grade the quarterback. He was open. That was a good route there. We're not grading the quarterback. It's not his fault. The quarterback didn't hit him. I seen him that him do that a couple times this game. When he'll have his receivers open, but man, that guy is not the best quarterback. Oh. He well, thanks for watching, guys. If you guys want me to do any more videos like this um, where I reach out and I will actually do a video for you, um, depending on who you guys want me to watch. Right now, I'm doing wide receivers, but um, just let me know down below and I'll let you know what I can do. Well, thanks, you guys, so much. Please subscribe. Hit the bell icon so you can never miss a video. And um, we'll see where we go from here. Thank you guys so much. I really appreciate all the love and support you guys have done so far. All right. Thanks, guys, and peace out.